I'm Mar from Beige here with my son. I'll let him take over. And off he goes. Hey YouTube, Dom from Team Beige here with a victory here at the KE Fairfax. We got a 4-0 victory in the 3v3 cash tournament. Me and my team, Team Curio, Danny and Froggy over there. And I was on Churia Rune. Nice, let's get into it. I was playing, honestly you gotta play three more crickets, three camella, and the, the bricks in quotations, sunflower, and stink bug. I used to be playing bamboo shoot back in darkwing blast format. Don't play it anymore guys, it's not worth it. It used to be worth it, but now it's not. Don't play bamboo shoot. No bamboo shoot. Next up we're playing three blessing and three sacred trees. Back when Tria first came good, people were talking about Sacred Tree 2. No, you played a 3. You definitely played a 3. Especially now that you're playing the Runic package. Hugin Pitch Sacred Tree is the best combo in the deck. There is no the combo in the deck better than Hugin Pitch Sacred Tree. How do you like Blessing at 3? Pretty amazing, honestly. Like, it gives the game a, a little more grind game. Because you tend to go through Camellias faster than the rest of your cards. So having that Blessing reborn it is pretty epic. Very nice. Then we play the four Ashizu cards, all limited, of course, because that's the banless moment. I believe that each one of these are strong in their own right. If I had to cut one, it'd be Minora. Yeah, that makes sense. And now, the spicy spice, let's move all this aside. Wow! The Runic cards. Play two Fountain. Yep. Two Slumber, because I, I was playing three Slumber. But one of the decks to be 40 cards, so I started to play two slumber. That's usually the struggle I found when I was playing this deck, is uh, getting into 40 and like the exactly. ratios. But you want to like see the spells, it's so weird. It's so hard. I said slumber is the best at two. Three runic tip. Three runic flash and fire. Three runic freezing curse. Oh, three runic destruction. And those are all the runic cards. So you play three all the good ones, two fountains, and two slumbers. You could play three slumber. I chose not to. But I'm not saying you can't play three slumber because it's probably just as good. Sure. And for the final six cards of our deck, we're playing Gamma Seal evenly. How'd you, like, how'd you like Gamma Seal? So it was literally Mage Best Team. Woo! Thank you. Woo. <laughs> oh man. Yes, so Gamma Seal. It was a last minute decision just today. My friend, shout out to my friend Ian from the Crush Cards uh, server, Crush Card server. He told me that the Kaiju is this format goaded. Because all the cash players play around the Biru. What they do, they do four summons, summoning a Rise Heart at the end. What bow? Or if you're playing the Ignister player, what bow? Labyrinth? What bow? Um, nice Brandon Mirror Jade's kind of whatever, but powing the Mirror Jade. Because they will nuke your board, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yes, they will. They will. They will. And evenly, main decking it in every deck I play right now, it's amazing. Evenly is ridiculous. Broken card. Awesome. Very I nice. This up and I got an extra check for you guys once I stop dropping my cards. Yeah, sure. Here, we'll just, uh, let's just. Yeah, off the just side. Uh, there we go. Take so, a nice extra. Runic cards, we play two Hugans and one, uh, what's his name? Wow. The Dwarf Man. Gary. I love this guy. He uh, achieved absolutely nothing today, but he was level four. That That's... didn't back me. Scarlet Red or Dragon Archfiends. Because me and the Apostle level four. Is this an oldie? It's sponsored by Danny. My good friend teammate and good friend uh, Danny gave me an ulti of Scarlet to be playing tonight. I don't actually own one. I own a secret. Come on, guys. This card is nuts. Um, for Link Monsters, you're playing Donner. Donner is an amazing removal. Uh, uh, and also negate bait. Negate bait, that is the word I'm looking for. And sprite sprint. You might sit wondering, why the heck are you playing sprite sprint? It's because I play scatter shot in the sideboard. That's it. That's the only reason. I love winning in time. That did not happen today. I actually lost in time. But that's okay. Well, do you have any XYZs? I do. I play one Babuska and the Secret Spice. One Shackanine, one Borbo, one Zeus. And you might be wondering, a deck that skips the battle phase, why are you playing Shackanine and Borbo? Well, it just works sometimes. So, more quick in effect, summoning two Camillas, one Camilla effect goes off, you Foolish Burial Tree, search a blessing, whatever, and then, let's say this is turn two. Opening Moon Cricket is 
and out to the board. Just opening more cricket. You don't even need the red cards. Opening more cricket is out to the majority of the, the game's boards. You can also go Keldo pitch uh, Fairy, and that's uh, two cards for Zeus, right? Exactly. Yeah. Or Ogido just being in existence. Oh, Ogido yeah, true. Existence. Super dope. And of course, finally, what you're all waiting for the Synchros and Scarlight. One Bark Yawn never came up, even against the Labyrinth player, because he flipped Imperial Iron Wall on me. Uh, Shuri Beast. Oh, wait, that was my teammate, Tech. Amazing. Truly amazing. Second pressure. I wish it came up, but it didn't. But if it did, it would have been great. And then the Charge Warrior. I love drawing cards. It was also necessary to be playing in the line against Baron, because it's obviously, as you might know already, Rick Spell. You make you again, you can pitch Sacred Tree, search Camilla, normal co or Mulcrit if you so choose to play a little more into Nib. Normal to Mulcrit or Camilla, use their effects, make, and then you synchro summon the Camilla, or the, Mulcrit, the Camilla summon off Mulcrit to make Star Warrior, draw a card, synchro summon, then use the blessing that you sent the tree off Camilla effect, you search blessing, you start summon the Camilla back, and then you make Baron Death Lord. Very nice. Baron on the floor, as they say. No Coral Dragon or Chain Yang? I couldn't find room for it. That's I mean, fair. These two could have been a Coral Dragon or Chain Yang. That's basic. I like Borbo. I like Chain Yang. Would you change anything from the extra deck? I guess I would remove Sprint because I never went to time. The only time I did was when I lost. So, just being salty, I would take out Sprint. Okay. Very nice. Yeah. Do you want to show us the side? Absolutely. Sure. So. It's a little messy right now, but we got... I got you, don't worry. One Nibiru, two Nibiru, dropping cards already, and three Nibiru. Three Nibiru, it's whatever. I never I never end up signing into it, so I never played Kashkash Jira. Never felt good. Probably would change this. Maybe, maybe not. I'm already playing a bunch of Kashkash Jira outs. I'd probably change it. Three Ash Blossom, a necessity in either the side or the main for Branded versus or Labyrinth. I used to think that Ash Blossom sucks in this format, in the sideboard, I think it's main deck or nothing. I changed my mind, guys. It's good. Yeah, because if they go like Unicorn or Fenrir, uh, you Ash, they just, you know, they, they hurt your board. Uh, and so it's like, it's, it's, it's hit or miss, yeah. I only used to side it against Labyrinth and Brandon. Brandon and yeah, side it against Kashira. Yeah. Three eventual barrier, broken card going first. I love saying no fusions against the Brandon player. Got three solemn judgments for the weird sprite players out there. The scatter shot for the sprint and two lava bowl. Very nice. Uh, anything you change? Just nips. Cool. Uh, I yeah. don't even know what to play some with. Dark on the wars? Maybe. I have no clue. Yeah. Maybe that's where the comments can come in. What do you think Dom should play over the Nibiru? Um, well, thank you so much, Dom, for this awesome profile. Uh, what were your matchups? Uh, Sword Soul's the only one I lost to. I beat more more Tronic FTK, Labyrinth, and Flounderies against my boy Nacho. Very nice. Any shoutouts you want to do? Uh, yes. Shout out to Mo, the great CEO alive. Literally look Besides at him. Besides me, no kidding, no, just Mo. Um, we got Head Judge, of course. Link. Link's over there. Where's Link? I lost it. Goomba, right there. I lost Link, but Goomba's right there. Um, shout out to Team Beige, the coolest Let's team go. alive. And I want to also shout out my parents for being supportive of my stupid hobby and money spending. We love to see it. Well, thank you so much, Dom, and we hope you all enjoyed the video, and we'll see you all next time. Farewell, guys. Peace.